In recognition of Black History Month, we continue to honor game changers, making a positive impact on communities of color in our area. KYW News Radio's Cherry Gregg took a trip to West Philadelphia, where a mother is fighting gun violence in the name of a lost loved one. This is me kicking butt out here. Meet Movita Johnson Harrell. I've really had to fight all my life. She's a warrior woman going head to head with gun violence. 26 days after my son died, his only child was born. A powerful voice at rallies and in city council. Movita's battle began after the mother of four moved her family to Delaware County to flee the violence in Southwest Philadelphia. But she learned it wasn't enough. January 15, 2011, I buried my son. Movita's youngest, Charles Andre Johnson, was gunned down in Philadelphia in a case of mistaken identity. He was 18. Devastating. It was devastating. Because I don't worry about my daughters. I worry about my sons. Movita, who also lost her father and brother to gun violence, funneled her grief into the Charles Foundation, a nonprofit that supports families of victims of homicide. I wish these families didn't have to go through this. Movita and her volunteers fund the effort helping victims through the process. The family may need food, they may need help with utilities. They also work with hundreds of youth, most likely to kill, and lobby lawmakers for better gun control. Last month, the UPenn educated social worker was named Victim Services Supervisor for the Philly DA's office. The homicide survivor has never sat in that seat before. She's hoping more will join the fight. Movita, there's a lot of people who look at gun violence and say, it's not in my backyard. I don't have to worry about it. What do you say? There is nobody that's going to come in and save us from this. We have to save ourselves. Armed with the family's love for a lost son, she's changing the game with her push to stop the killing. Cherry Gregg, KW News Radio for CBS3 Eyewitness News. Will be to change that game. Moms are powerful. Indeed. That's right. I love it. Love it.